Good day. Welcome to King William Was Everything. We got some retro old tech here. We have a old old processor, and this is actually one of the latter the latter of these this version. This is a slot one uh, from Intel. It's an Intel Celeron. I can't remember what this one was. I think it was like maybe seven hundred thirty three or nine thirty one hundred thirty three megahertz, not gigahertz, megahertz. You can see it's got a beastie, but what Intel had done for a while, you know, because they didn't want anybody uh, putting chips in their their boards and copying their stuff, they put it on a, a, a circuit board and then copyrighted the circuit board or patented, whatever. So you cannot make your own, so you had to buy their crap. But this is one of the latter ones. Some of the earlier ones uh, they had, they were all in like a black piece of plastic, so you couldn't even see the board or anything like that. It was just covered. And instead of putting it in a socket, you put it in the slot, bam, and away you went. But there's a certain point where there was kind of limited how fast they can go, that kind of thing, the, the bus and stuff like that. So they went back to the chip. And they switched to a from a slot one to socket 370. So at that point, you're screwed because you can't upgrade your motherboard anymore with something like this because this is all there was. So you had to buy a new motherboard. Good for Intel, bad for the consumer. But some wily Chinese guys, maybe Americans, probably Chinese, did something cool. They did what's called a slocket. And what it did was, see I broke the seal on this guy. They created a slot one to socket 370 adapter. You can kind of see it's got a bunch of jumpers here, so you can set the, the speed of this guy. And there's some other jumpers over here. I can't remember what the jumpers were all for. I know some of them set the clock speeds and stuff like that. So you had to manually set all these little jumpers, put the right processor that you wanted in there. And this was, what's nice about this, it was, let's see there. Open it up, plop it in, put your little heat sink on there, and away you went. And as long as these were set correctly, you plop it in your slot one and you could reuse your motherboard. So what they would do, um, so say you had a Pentium 500, you could put this in there, put a one gigahertz uh, 370 chip in there and basically double your processor speed. You wouldn't really speed up the bus, uh, bus of it, but the processor speed would speed up. So you get quite a bit of a uh, um, uh, power update just by using something like this. So that's what kind of what this did. So it was a really neat product for the time. And there's still people, they buy these because uh, there's still people with these old old machines doing whatever they do. They want to get something a little, you know, a little bit more processor speed out of it. This is what you would do. It's kind of weird because between that transition, there's really, you didn't see a lot of these. These were kind of weird things out there. But if you knew about them, you could find them. And this actually comes with the manual, so you can see socket 370. Um card version 5 so this has been out for a while but you can see it's got lots of all the little jumper settings so you really had to go through this and set um, what you wanted so you can kind of see let's see uh, some of the core speeds and stuff like that or the, the clock speeds uh, here you can set the voltages here's for your front side bus so you can see depending on what kind of a uh, card you had you would set this correctly and you kind of see the retention, how you slide it in is basically slide it in the slot, where you go. Pretty easy. So that's kind of a slocket. It's called a slocket. So a slot one to socket adapter. And you'll see these on eBay. Um, they don't go for much anymore. I can't remember what I paid for these because I was upgrading computers for people. And sometimes people would have one of these guys. You can get a chip for nothing, this for nothing, and you know, the, the customer gets a faster computer with basically, you know, swapping out a part. So that's kind of cool. But that's basically what that did. It took this. And this is actually one of the, the latter ones, the, I think the earlier ones. Uh, like I said, it was all encased. And towards the end, Intel just put it on a card. Took off the housing to save some cash. But you can see the heat sink on this beast. Monstrosity. But this one, you'd put the little heat seek on there. And I think, I'm trying to remember, I think 
you'd put a little fan on it, kind of like a little fan like this, um, with the heat sink. So it didn't really take up much more space than this guy, but um, you know, you would get the, the speed, speed increase. So that is a Slocket adapter. Have a great day.